Hello, my name is Nate Shelton, and I will show our 3D model done on the building block game called Minecraft. First of all, we had many problems overcoming obstacles with the measurements and the size of the block in the game. Like if there was 19 feet and 4 inches, we can only go with 19 feet. We started measurements on the outside of the walls of the school at the east wing and circled our way around the school clockwise, measuring everything that we thought was needed. Then worked our way through the inside of the school in the west wing upstairs, eventually leaving the first floor over towards the east wing to be measured last. Like hallways in larger rooms, like the gym or the library, were measured some things. We didn't measure either because we thought that they were too small or we couldn't fit them on the 3D model. Classrooms were not measured except for geometry class, and some of the small details like flagpoles or flowers or seats are just decorations that we added. After finishing the measurements, we decided to use a scale factor of 5. 5 feet equals 1 block in the model. We decided this so we could get a better measurement of the height of the school. After 3 days of building the 3D model, we were almost finished, and while working on the blueprints um, a little bit more, someone had pointed out that our original scale factor of 5 was too large because doorways are not 5 feet wide. We changed the scale factor to 3 feet to equal 1 block because the doors are just about 3 feet long, but we had to rebuild a new 3D model of the school with a new scale factor. With the new scale factor, excuse me. And, uh, we uh, completed this new model in two days, and it took many hours to complete uh, this as neat as possible. Our group met during seminars to get like more measurements that we found was needed. In the creation of the new 3D model, we first started off creating the outside walls, then adding the insides, like hallways and rooms and whatnot. While adding in the insides, one of us started working on the hills and the elevation around the school and another person started on the roofing of the school. Completing the roof and the heights and the decorations were the last things that we did, like in front of the school or some classrooms in the library and the office. Finally, our improvements to the school would be an auditorium, an auditorium, excuse me. We think this should be an improvement to the school because of its many different features. Some uses include concerts and performances, graduations, and other student functions. This would be great for concert and symphonic bands to improve better sound quality and tuning for district and state festivals. Thank you for watching.